Morningstar is a world leader in precision mapping, and this is used specifically with businesses associated with construction and management of infrastructure. With me is the CEO, Paige Tucker, to explain the company, and I remember we talked once on Zoom, and um, we talked about just what you do is kind of unseen, but so important. So give me an overview of ProStar. So as you mentioned, we consider ourselves the world leader in the development of precision mapping solutions. And we have designed a solution that works on a standard mobile app that provides centimeter accuracy. And specifically, the solution is designed to capture, record, and display the precise location of buried infrastructure, including utilities and pipelines. Okay, and so why is that important? Why do I need to know where these utility lines are? Well, unfortunately, in the United States, we don't really have any good information that's accurate on where the utilities and pipelines are buried. And any time you do construction, including on the above ground infrastructure, which could be our roads or our bridges or highways, or if we're trying to repair or replace water systems, sewage systems, or even putting fiber optic into the ground, if we don't know where the utilities and pipelines are buried, there's a high probability that we could hit a utility or pipeline during construction and when you hit a utility or pipeline, some really bad things can happen. Mm -hmm. You could have dangerous petroleum products that are seeping into our water systems. You could have, for example, if you hit a high pressure gas line, high probability that you're gonna have an explosion. Mm -hmm. And when you do, serious injuries incurred either by the worker or the public, yeah. or you could have loss of life. And that's actually a major problem is that the amount of deaths that we have every year is to the point where it's simply unacceptable. Oh, interesting. How do you map? What kind of technology are you using? So basically what we're doing is we're using existing equipment that can identify where a utility or a pipeline is located, but traditionally they don't capture any information. So we're taking the equipment and we're integrating it with GPS systems that give us the precise geospatial location. And when you combine our technology with the GPS, with the standard mobile device, with the equipment that can actually locate where the utilities and pipelines are located, we have the ability to digitally capture the precise location onto the mobile device. We send that information up to the cloud where we do all of our calculations through our proprietary algorithms, okay. and we make that information available to whoever needs it in a matter of seconds. Interesting. So talk to me about sales a little bit. I'm guessing utilities would be a customer, governments maybe, like who are your main customers? Yeah, it's pretty broad. It's basically anyone that's impacted by not knowing where utilities and pipelines are buried. So major construction companies, engineering and surveying firms, municipalities, mining companies, Department of Transportation, pretty much anyone that is impacted, again, by not knowing where these utilities and pipelines are buried. Now, this infrastructure bill was passed, I guess, last year, maybe? Has that, will that benefit the company? Absolutely. So, yeah, $1.2 trillion infrastructure bill was passed, of which several hundreds of billions is earmarked for what I consider to be critical infrastructure. So your roads, bridges, highways, also to repair and expand um, our water systems and our sewage systems as well as the fiber optic. Mm -hmm. So okay. that will definitely um, impact our company because again with all of that construction there's going to be a high probability that we're going to have a lot of utility and pipeline strikes or damages if we don't know the precise location. Yeah. Now Patrick Clausen, so uh, he's leading your sales initiative. I'm talking about him, what does he bring to the company? Yeah, we just brought Mr. Clausen in and uh, he has basically already had a huge impact on our sales and marketing operations. He also, uh, we placed him on the board as well. But his background is coming in with early stage technology companies and really optimizing their sales and marketing and significantly increasing their, their revenue and he's already starting to do that for okay. us. Okay, so what does that, uh, what does it look like for the company next 12 to 24 months? I'm sure Patrick plays an important role in that. Absolutely. Mm -hmm. um, it took several years to get to the point where we had what we call early adopters to actually adopt our technology and test it and validate that we could actually locate where these utilities and pipelines are just on a standard mobile device. But we're at the point now where we have Fortune 500 construction companies, government agencies, some of the largest engineering surveying firms that are using our technology. And that gives us the credibility to be able to go out and market much more broadly. Yeah. So we're significantly increasing the amount of customers that we have now, not only in the United States, but also around the world. Yeah, it's kind of a proof of concept. It shows That's what you've exactly got really right. works. So now you're based in Colorado, but you're in New York today. So what brings you to New York City? 
Um, actually, in New York, we're doing a demonstration for the city of New York. Oh. They asked us to come out and provide to them our solution and demonstrate actually how it works. So we're working with one of the large engineering surveying firms that's a client of ours, and they're going to shut down a section, I believe it's in Queens, and we're going to demonstrate exactly how our solution works for oh. the city of New Maybe York. Maybe we could do something about whenever it rains, there's water at every curb. So. <laughs> <laughs> anyway, okay, so um, the digitization of infrastructure and what you do, how will that look in the future? Well, what might surprise people right now is that the majority of utilities and pipelines aren't mapped to any level of uh, say precision based on the fact they're not digital. The majority of utilities and pipelines, if they're mapped at all, are still on paper systems. So anytime you can provide any type of digital information, as a result of that, you can, opt you can optimize the ability to perform, be more efficient, and obviously make better business decisions. So that is our goal, is to be the leader and lead the construction industry and critical infrastructure into what I call the uh, digital era. Well, yeah, interesting, an industry that hasn't really been digitized yet, so exactly. a lot of room there. Paige, thank you so much, great to meet you. Absolute pleasure, thank uh -huh. you.